Red Wing, the sixth series of nuclear tests conducted in the Pacific Proving Ground, was nearly three times the magnitude of that of any previous one. The purpose of Red Wing was twofold. To test 17 experimental weapons and devices, to conduct some 43 weapons effects tests and diagnostic measurements associated with the 17 shots. The cost of Red Wing was on the order of $160 million. Tewa was the final shot at Bikini Atoll during Operation Red Wing. The Bassoon Prime device was a dirty variant of the Zuni device. It was a three-stage design, the first of its kind produced in the United States. The device itself measured 39 inches in diameter. 135.5 inches long, and weighed 15,735 pounds. The barge, to which the device and other test equipment were attached, was situated on the reef between the islands of Namu and Urochi. Tewa was detonated at 546 on July 21, 1956, with a yield of 5 megatons, making it the largest Red Wing event. The cloud reached a height of 90,000 feet, with a base of 30,000 feet. The cloud proceeded west toward Aniwatok, with the exception of the lowest half, which drifted east. A crater of 4,000 feet in diameter and 129 feet in depth had been blasted into the reef. Tewa had the largest known fission yield of any thermonuclear test conducted by the United States, accounting for 87% of the overall output. The lead tamper used in the Zuni test was replaced with uranium, which resulted in a significant fission output and associated fallout. The device was later developed into the B-41, the United States' most powerful nuclear weapon. <laughs>